This is Dabu7. want to talk about 17 key principles when it comes to martial law. And if you find yourself in a situation where you can check off all 17 of these principles as a yes or in progress, well then you very well may be on the cusp of martial law or in martial law, even though the people around you may not even realize it. It may not be looking like it on the street, or maybe it is, or starting to. But the laws have been changed. Where people, since it's not affecting them directly, they don't do anything. A la NDAA. Okay? Now, number one is the mass roundup of political dissidents. You go back and you look at the Occupy situation. Everything that was talked about and strategized there with leaders and removing them. And that's always at the top of the agenda here. Dust till dawn curfews. Some cities have already seen this. And of course, they want this to go down because they don't want anyone out there operating under the cover of darkness. And more importantly, if anything was to pop off, they want to know where to find individuals the rationing of essential resources well yes and you'll find me referencing the NDAA several times because it it has sweeping measures and powers that it gives Obama which it ha- it has none to be honest with you because it does not abide by the constitution and that's what many people are out here arguing but you can sit here and argue and argue we got to try to reach the minds of the other people out here. It's a battle to get them this knowledge and to let them see where they're at and to see the facts. You want to talk about the the rationing of essential resources. I mean, you start to look at the West Coast and everything they're going through there. The seizing of personal assets, all of that tied directly into the NDAA. Okay? Control over all of it. Put into motion. And for those of you that don't know, just research NDAA and you'll get quite an awakening. Most of you following me are hip to the NDAA and you know what it's all about. And like I said, it's one of those things that are put in into place. It was put into place to where at any moment, given he announces it's an emergency, they have full control over all of this. Okay? The prohibition of weapons of any kind in progress. This is one of those things that is ongoing. Talk about the UN Small Arms Treaty. Them setting up shop in New York City to train individuals. Okay? The confiscation of property, homes, businesses. Arrest without due process. Checkpoints. Searches. Once again... Going right back to the NDAA. Forced relocation. Forced conscription into various labor camps and even into military. Well, for those of you that missed it, me and quite a few other channels out here covered the internment and resettlement operations program. Tore into that whole thing and that's a story all alone. Outlawing a free speech? Yeah, when you can't say certain things on certain platforms freely off your chest. How many of you out there know what I'm saying? Yeah. Without getting a strike or getting cut down. Control of the media. Tying right into it. You all know the massive surveillance programs. NSA. Everything. Watching everything we do. And... can see net neutrality is another thing that has been set up out here okay once again as we talked before it was pushed out front as a good thing which many things are but ticker taped into it the loopholes the fine print give them the control that they seek over all of this okay and the constant quest here for the elimination of Religion, executions without due process, 
the total suspension of the Constitution? Well, you don't have to look any further than drone strikes in other countries of innocent individuals, even Americans, and not just the terrorists they want to blame it all on. They say, oh, this person was a terrorist. How about the family members, everyone else that executed, even the kids from drone strikes? Well, these are the 17 points that are critical in paying attention to. And you might want to look at your surroundings and go down this checklist, as I just did, and see where you find yourself sitting. Because... Some of you countries out there, you obviously don't have the NDAA, but you might have something else out there that is equal to it. Bring it to the forefront. Shed some light on it. Let some people know about it. Let's see what's happening everywhere else as well here. But, you know, for my fellow Americans, this is where it sits. And you want to talk about Jade Helm going live? Well, time and time again, we've watched many drills go live. My problem with this is the fact that the leadership, the our military leadership on the ground has already admitted that they're being basically kept in the dark in certain aspects when it comes to Jade Helm and this massive operation. The Pentagon and all them, there's no um, direct order given for what these well, should I say rules of engagement for these drills, which means that they can switch or and shift at any given time. I'll leave links. This has been Dabu7. Stay sharp. Stay smart. This is Illuminati.